All right, guys, so this is it. This is a miniature version of a mining rig. Now, this is a laptop version with a USB drive, which is a, pretty much like a small uh, miniature mining rig, if you will. Uh, but this will give you the general idea how to set up a mining rig. Now, uh, my friend Nino is going to explain more about this and he'll let you know, is it really worth mining on a laptop versus a big mining rig that's real expensive? Now, um, Nino, how yeah. much was that uh, this USB device to mine? Yeah, that USB miner is called the Moonlander, Moonlander 2. And that one costs a um, hundred, a hundred forty dollars, and it's called a USB um, Litecoin miner. It's an ASIC miner. They range between like what, a hundred and forty and yeah, price range from a hundred forty to like two hundred, two hundred dollars plus. Yeah, when they're in demand, probably. Yeah. Does it get hot? It gets hot, um, but it has its own fan. That it's huge. Its own, yeah, it has its own fan, and then it has its own heatsink. It's not really noisy. Um, the fan is actually kind of quiet. Yeah. Did you, um, it's all opened like that or did you take off the case? It's all open like that. All right. Yeah. And do you make any money on this? Not much. <laughs> oh, so uh, what's so, the results? You have any um, stats? stats? Well, so far I've made, for, for the last 20 days, I made 0 0.01, 0 0.01 Litecoin. What are you, what are you mining? Oh, oh Litecoin, this yeah, one. Yeah, this is, this is Litecoin. Why, why Litecoin on, um, can you mine other currencies on on this little rig? You can, but it has to be script, script um, coins. Oh, all right. Yeah, script algorithm coins. So Litecoin is probably the best bet for, yeah. for this little miniature device. Yes. All right, so let's check out the uh, stats you have. So from for this device, you can make um, 0 0.006 every 24 hours what is uh is that uh coin or money that's uh point zero 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 six of a light coin oh so how much is that worth right there um and uh, here let's go here uh let's see this so this one is saying what you can mine per day so right now this is uh pulling four point four seven but averaging like four point four what's four point four of um four point five mega hashes Oh, the so, um, oh, energy, electricity. No, that's, that's how the power of the. I mean, that's how fast it it. Oh, but, gotcha. Yeah. Oh, and then right here is power consumed uh, watts. Yes. Thirty. That's well, well, the this one itself um, only consumes ten watts. Okay. But then with the laptop, you're probably consuming around thirty watts without the screen. Oh, when you turn off the screen. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. So, um, um, how so much is you, that? If you look here. Um, with 0.10 cost per kilowatt, um, this it comes up with this result, and it's saying here that you can mine 0 0.005937 per day, and that's pretty close to what I'm making. So, um, this one's actually higher. I'm making 0 0.006. All right. Every 24 hours, that's per day. So what's that and week? Per week. You you can make point zero zero four twenty five cents a week. So point zero zero four one five six. So if you're in a third world country, this is good money. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so this is like twelve bucks a year. That's twelve bucks a year. Yeah. So you're not really gonna make a lot of money on this one. I mean, this is just to learn learn. tool. Yeah. This, yeah. This is just to learn how everything connects together. And I, that was the main purpose why. That's I how you started. Yeah, that's the main purpose why I purchased this Moonlander. Just did, it, did it actually teach you? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you you have to figure out the the software part, um, joining joining um, what is called is joining a pool. Yeah. What's the minimum you can sell? I'm not sure what the minimum is, but I think you you can you can sell portions of it. Yeah. Yeah. So you can get your twelve bucks back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's go and check out. And uh, the bigger mining rig, which everyone's probably more interested in. All right. All right. So here is Nino's bread and butter. This is the full mining rig. Actually, I think you're adding to it. Uh, if, uh, if I'm not mistaken. One more GPU. One more GPU. Uh, uh, I think I can go up to eight. There are now five GPUs, and they're all um, GTX 1060s. Why did you choose? 
GTX 1060 instead of the GTX 1080. The, the GTX 1060 only uses um, about 90 watts, 75 to 90 watts per GPU. The, the 1080 I think uses ab about 150 to 200 watts per GPU. And the 1060 can, can generate 10, oh no, sorry, 20 mega hashes per GPU. So it's the best value you're saying? Well, well the 1080 can do 30 mega hash. And, and as far as price... Um, How much is the 1060? The 1060 G is about $300. Versus the 1080. The 1080 is about 600 so Wow, that's a big difference. So that's yeah. savings. So you're looking more about value yeah. when, you built, so you when can, you built the rig. Correct. So you can get two 1060s for a price of one. And it uses less and electricity. Then, yeah, and then you only you can get 40 mega hashes for the two GPUs um, compared to just 30 mega hashes for the 10. And then electricity wise, um, you're only consuming about this about 180 watts for the two GPUs, uh, while for for 1080 you're consuming the same for one. For gotcha. One so you get more mega hashes or mega hashes. So why did you choose, all right, so I understand why um, you chose um, the GTX uh, graphics card 1060, but why is it, um, so um, you're mining Bitcoin. No, you're mining Ethereum. You're mining Ether, yeah. Ethereum, yeah. all right, and you have to use a graphics card, why not CPU? Um, for, for Ethereum, um, the best, uh, the GPU has a higher um, mega performance. Hashes. Yeah, higher mega hashes compared to the CPU. And so, what kind of uh, CPU do you have? Uh, did you buy? I think I have an Intel Pentium um, 3.3. I think. Where is that at? Oh, there it is. I see it down there. It's this one. And so, so you don't really need a. This is like an um, entry level. Um, yeah. So I don't know, I think it's CPU. The level, and then this one's like the Pentium. And then I think that's a dual core. Looks like yeah, that's an Intel Pentium. So the low, the lowest I think you can get is a Celeron, but that should also work. Oh really? Yeah, Celeron should work as long as because all the processing power is done by the GPU. It's not by, but not by the CPU in this case. And then why did you choose a 250 um, Samsung SSD? Did you, can you use uh, any hard drive? You can use any hard hard drive. I think you should have at least 120. 120 gigs. 120 gigs, so I just went um, twice that, which is 250 gig, and I used a solid state drive instead of a regular drive, so that it um, saves electricity. Oh, saves electricity, and then, and then it processes better. Yeah, they do save electricity, and it um, yeah, it's performance too. And it's then, better. Yeah, and the for the power supply, I use the HX 1000i, and the nice thing about that is you can monitor uh, how much electricity it's your your whole rig is consuming. And there's a software right here I can actually show you that. So how much was that uh, power supply? I think the power supply is around 200. I'll just make a list. I'll make a list and um, put everything in the video description below if you guys are interested in the parts list. And also uh, I'll leave a link to Nino's channel where he gets in more into detail and help you guys, help you guys out if you're as actually interested in um, doing this for a living or even as a hobby. And then um, how many? Fa you looks like you got uh, five fans going. Oh. I got five. There's five fans total and four running right now. Um, once I get the six uh, GPU installed, then I'll have uh, the five. How much was uh, each running. fan? And for four fans, you can get it for like fourteen bucks, fourteen it's cheap dollars. And they're quiet. Yeah, it's quiet. It's really not hot at all. I thought this thing would be loud and like like a, a heater in your house, but it's. It's actually really quiet and doesn't produce too much heat at all. Yep. Yeah. And the way the fan is working now, it's it's a uh, counterflow to the GPU. Now, what is that down here? This is the rig, right? This is the case. That's the that's the rack. This the rack. Called a six bay uh, minor so, case. So how big? How many? So um, this one. This rack will hold how many GPUs? It will hold six six GPUs, and I think there's also an eight. An eight bay rack that you can get. Okay. Um, 
And for the motherboard, they have the TV, the bi the Biostar, I think it's Biostar. Oh, that's the yeah. motherboard down there? Biostar uh, TV250 BTC Plus. Okay. Um, and that's the Pro, and that one can, can have as much as eight GPUs. Um, currently, it can, I only have five, so, so I can go all the way up to wow. eight. So you can squeeze in somehow, probably down there, another uh, yeah, it, a couple yeah wow and then what happens if like all right let's just talk about um the specs so it looks like uh, how much will all this like cost this whole total like cost for this whole rig that you have currently going on was it five it's a five it's gpus between three three thousand probably to three thousand five hundred all right so when are you going to turn around a profit i think i think that's what everyone wants to know all is right. it profitable Okay, what's the ROI, right? So right now I'm hashing 102 hashes. If you look here, um, it will show your total hash rate. Oh, I don't even know what that. So that looks... that's 101, 99, 100, 102. So my best rate is like 102. That so looks confusing right there. So I put here 102. Oh, that's why you put that number there? So these are accurate numbers. Yeah, and I'm using about 450 kilo... Uh, 500, 450 watts. 450 watts. And we can... I can show you. How much it's pulling? I mean, how much? How many watts it's pulling? Oh, so this shows you actually uh, real results, yeah. real life. Okay. Uh, all right. I'm yeah. thinking I'm in your way. <laughs> so, if I click this, you're gonna see a 450. Is, it fluctuates 444. 444 looks like yeah. It jumps yeah, around. But then the power out is 441. So I would say it's using about 450 watts average. All right. And so you put that number in the crypto compare yep. so website. So first we put the hash rate, which is 102 mega hashes. Okay. Power consumption is 450 watts. Average, yeah. Electricity cost is 10. Currently. 10 cents per kilowatt. Yeah. Power. And the pool fee. So I'm mining in nano pool, and it has a 1% pool fee. So this one will tell you how much you're going to be making per day. 0.009 per week you're going to be making points so you're mining six. ether yeah this is ether e ethereum this is this is the dollar amount this is the ether so what would ether is um currently running at thousand dollars for yeah. one ether one ether is like a thousand dollars 64. now if that um the market for that goes up then you're making um, um because you're mining you're making uh, you're making more money yeah yeah when that goes up then you're Profit goes up, when that goes down, then your profit goes down. It just kind of follows that that um, formula. All right, and then so your so profit, um, how long has this been running? It's been running now for 20, I would say 20 days. And so your total profit for this month is, is that it right there? Uh, since I started. 270, is that well, so? Yeah, well this is, this is like how much you will get with 102 mega hashes. So if you have 102 mega hashes and you run it for a month, you'll be making $270 per month. Um, $63 per week, $9 a day. Or in one year, that's like $3,200 a year. So after a year, it this, pay, um, this pays for itself after a year, the rig. Yeah, yeah. So your ROI is about a year. So you gotta be patient. This is an investment. Yeah, and that's five GPUs. So, so, so the next year is all profit. I, if I get correct, so if I get another GPU, this goes up to one twenty-two, and my electricity will also go up by another hundred. Just let's say it goes up to five fifty. Mm -hmm. This will be constant, and that's constant. Your profit for, for the year jumps up to three nine. Wow. Oh. For if you go up to so GPUs. it's it's probably worth it. And if you go even further, Looks you go like, up to yeah. eight. That's it maxed out. That's yeah. your. So at 122, let's add another three GPUs. That it means I can add another 60. So let's say I go up to 180. That's if you max out your rig. Yeah. Well, why are you mining Ether versus like Bitcoin or Litecoin or any other cryptocurrency? Why Ether? Well, Ether um, is like the number two, I think, compared to Bitcoin. Um, and it's 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 uh it's profitable for gpus i mean for a gpu 
Jig. Yeah. That's one of the rough toy. So it gives you the most bang for your buck or like yeah. mining wise? Yeah. And you can you can find it out in there's a website where you can find out. Oh let's check that out. It's called what? You're full of knowledge. You guys have to subscribe to Nino's <laughs> channel. This guy knows everything about cryptocurrency. I know nothing. Well, I know a little bit about cryptocurrency, but this guy knows way more than me. So I'll leave a link in the video description below. If you guys are interested in um, to learn more, check out Nino's channel. He's gonna post a um, video about uh, going into detail. Yeah, so here you say you're in what mine, and then you say you have six. Let's say you have six GPUs. All right. And cut it. And it's gonna tell you what is the most profitable. So right now it's saying Z Classic is the most profitable. But that's not too popular. So and Ethereum is right here. It's like <clears throat> so it's up there. Yeah. So and this is how much you think you can Where's Bitcoin? It isn't even up there. No, this is only for what you can mine with. with oh you can't mine um, can Bitcoin mine with, with uh, GPUs. No, all right yeah. you need a totally different setup yep. gotcha and so so you decided to go with ether, go with ether. Um, what, what's your profit for if you're going to do litecoin for example oh like or bitcash let's let's G classic so this is like this one is saying your estimated rewards for 24 hours difficulty block time let's change your market cap I'm asking so many questions. Four, Sorry. Four hours. I'm like <laughs> interrogating. I'm interrogating you. <laughs> yeah, but this was the number four. So Ethereum's a number four right now. It's us. Um, but it, Ether is popular. And, well, it's on yep. Coinbase. Right? I don't think the others are on Coinbase, right? The only the only coins that are in Coinbase is Bitcoin, um, Litecoin, B um, B Bitcoin Cash. Ethereum, yeah, Bitcoin Cash and Ethereum. Yeah. Yeah. And those are popular. The most popular looks like. Yeah. And I don't know, just like Ethereum. Um, I heard a lot of good recommendations about. Me this. too. I heard the. Um, what was it the blockchain it has more technology behind it it's better it's like a little bit better version yeah of cause i think you can add there's you can add programs inside uh, inside the ledger it's something like that so you can you can do more than just you know buy i mean buy stuff bitcoin's good uh but i heard this ether is a little bit improved version of uh, kind of like bitcoin right yeah all right that's how much it's been that's how many shares i'm putting per hour of ether uh, just the shares oh so you get 84 94 oh in the pool you're talking about yeah are you creating a series of cryptocurrency series yeah i'll, I'll be i'll be doing that yeah i'll be <laughs> trying to explain how i how i got into cryptocurrency and uh like everything i need to get to where i am now all right exciting stuff so if you guys are definitely interested in uh mining cryptocurrency making money as a hobby or a full-time job subscribe to Nino's channel and follow the link in the video description below if you guys found this video informative give me a big thumbs up and if you want more how-to videos like this coming your way subscribe to Tampa Tech click on this link right here and if you want to uh, check out my other how-to videos click on this playlist right here and if you guys are interested in any of the items shown in this video to build a mining rig Check out the links in the video description below. Those support the channel. Thanks for watching.